Uh, we're here with Carlos Torres from uh, Timeline Gallery in California. Hi, Carlos. Hello. So, man, welcome. How you guys doing? Real good. Yeah. What's What's new? Oh man, I had a ton of everything. I tell you, um, <laughs> I've um, just always, you know, always tattooing and painting. That that's enough to keep keep you busy and drive drive you crazy. And uh, actually, cut out a little bit of traveling. Um, uh, bought into uh, the company Inkies. No yeah. Self motion. Sorry. So cool. tell <laughs> tell us a little bit about that. Um. Well, you know, I, I I've been um, you know the the uh the thing with nowadays you know like the sponsorships and everything and uh i don't know i just uh i uh been using the product for a couple years and um they were asking me about it and i i asked uh, you know about being a uh, being sponsored and i just kind of asked like well what's it take to uh buy a piece of the company and man they uh uh they asked me they said all right here's the whole story so I'm tat I tattoo 50 cent and I'm not trying to throw this out there, right? But this guy's like a brilliant, a brilliant marketing man, right? Oh yeah. Very smart so, businessman. Yeah. So he told me, he was like, well, you know, don't, don't let, you know, you should, you should, uh, if you're going to, you, people are going to use your name, you should uh, ask to get a piece of the company like he did with vitamin water. Right. Right. So basically that's what I did. <laughs> then they said, sure. And then I was like, all right, I don't know what to do now. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> I literally had to call 50 and be like, hey, hey man, uh, what do I do now? <laughs> but uh, no, you know, it's, it's, a good, it's a good product, and I've been using it for years, and I figured why not promote something that I truly believe in. And um, yeah, and I mean, I, I do have, uh, I got belief in it, so why not? Yeah, right on, man. So uh, for, for those who don't know, what exactly is the product? Well, Inkies started off as a, um, a numbing uh, agent, which uh, we, we are actually taking that back to um, the drawing board. Uh, we have a product called Green Glide, which is just like an av uh, everyday tattoo ointment that, that you tattoo with. Um, and it's also can be used as a healing cream. Uh, we have a couple healing creams, uh, or, or a, we have a healing cream, some um, sunblock, and um and like a, a lotion cool and uh you know uh, they they also we have some products that are for tattooers which is what i really wanted to be behind uh a lot of a lot of people know i travel a lot so i really w we're working on a line of like travel friendly um products we have the bio gel that, that you pour in the water and it solidifies the water I don't oh. know if you've ever seen that so, you know what? I think I have seen something like it. So, like, if you have, I've seen it. They've used it in uh, like rinse cups and stuff, right? You can dump it in, yeah. and it, and and you don't have to put a disgusting cup full of <laughs> rinse in a trash. It, 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 it turns into a solid almost. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you, you know, like when I when they first gave me that product, uh, and just always being on the road, I I, I was like, I first of all, I, I still geek out on on seeing the water turn into this like solid, but. Uh, yeah, so so uh, when they first gave me that, I, I was just like, like, oh, that's that's genius, like perfect for traveling tattoo artist, and you know that that's one of the products that I really want to push. Um, of, of course, you know, being sterile and yeah, like you say, you don't want to throw that disgusting water paper towel mix in the. Trash. Well, I mean, you see it at conventions uh, or uh, over and over and over again, you know, and then it's just like leaking trash bags and it's just gross it's, yeah. it's, it's gross yeah, no need for that man <laughs> exactly well that's cool where can uh, where can people get their pro your products you guys are online right yeah 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 uh, at uh, inkies um, dot com and, cool uh, yeah so uh, you say you're not been travel you're not going to be traveling that much but you are going to be doing the Empire State Tattoo Expo yeah, you, you know, uh, I I, I kind of just cut out for um, for the for these past few months. I'll, I'll be at the NY uh, um, Empire State uh, Convention. Um, of course, uh, you know Stefano's throwing it, man. He's such a good dude, and like, you know, of course I, I gotta be there to support him and see what you what it, you know what everybody's coming up with over there. We'll be there too. Oh, right on, perfect. Yeah, uh, I get to interview Paul Booth on stage and uh, and Nico. Lucky you. That'll be fun. <laughs> Is that so, nerve-wracking? Uh, 
Yeah, um, it is. I, actually, I interviewed Paul Booth like this on Sunday, and it, yeah. it is nerve-wracking because, yeah. you know, who the fuck am I? I'm just a guy, you know, on the other side of a camera. <laughs> yeah. Dude, I, st I still but, get nervous when I talk to him and, like, Jack Rudy. Uh -huh. Man, I, I just, like, clam up. I'm, I'm, I think that's probably my... Or, or that's 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 my starstruck, uh, you know. It's good because like that means you know you're not you're not so egotistical that you that you're above it. You know, it's I think it's it's good to still feel that kind of you know respect. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I mean, I, yeah, I got I got superstars and guys, you know, <laughs> I got idols. <laughs> that's good. So you're gonna be doing a seminar while you're there, right? Yeah. Yeah. What, what's that all about? Uh. I really want to go over uh, like like um, the importance of values um, and uh, uh, darks and lights. Also, um, one thing that I, I feel like it, it seems to be lost sometimes is um, the the importance of flow on the body and, and composition. Um, and and so I, I don't know, it's just stuff that I really like to add into my tattoos, uh, and, and hopefully um, people will listen uh, or. Not listen, not listen, not, 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 I hope that that didn't come out wrong. I just mean like, hopefully they could take something from it, I guess. <laughs> yeah, right on, man. Yeah. Um, you're going to be giving away a four-hour tattoo to someone who signs up? Yeah? Yeah, yeah I mean, I mean uh, I'm, I'm not, I've never been really good at speaking in front of people. So uh, uh, this probably, this is actually the only second seminar I've ever done. And so what I was figuring is um, uh, I can tattoo someone. And it makes it a lot easier for me to go through my thought process and explain like what I'm thinking, why I'm thinking it, um, and, and and why I do things the way I'm doing them. You know. Right on. Yeah. So, you, so you're gonna pick someone from the class, tattoo them, and then explain what you're doing, and let people ask questions and whatnot. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, right on. Seems. It yeah. sounds a lot like the webinars that we do. Oh yeah. Yeah. It's, <laughs> you know, we do a lot of that kind of stuff around here. Yeah. <laughs> Would you ever do anything like that online? Yeah, of course. Yeah, of course. Yeah, man, of course. I, I would be definitely be down for that. Cool. Uh, I tattoo slow though. I'll warn you guys right now. I did one with Bob Tyrell. Okay, and never mind. It took. It was like eleven hours. <laughs> eleven hours. All right. And uh, what we ended up doing is we put the whole thing up available for people if they want to watch it. And uh, I don't know if you've seen Bob's new DVD that we just put out. But uh, we, uh, we condensed it down into a couple hours and made a DVD from it. So then it, ha it hits all the, all the high points and of his webinar. But there's people that watch the whole damn 11 hours because they want to see, you know, line by line, they want to see exactly the way he does it. Yeah, I get, you, know? you know, see a genius at work, you know. Uh, I just did one with Tommy Helm not too long ago. Rember's doing one. Oh, nice. Yeah. So. Oh, he's a uh, good dude. Yeah, I like him a lot. He works his ass off. He just doesn't stop. He just yeah, man makes makes you feel lazy, man. Yeah, he just goes and goes and goes and goes and goes. <laughs> you, I mean, you work your ass off too, though. You're painting. You got you own your own place and you're tattooing. Do you find that hard to juggle? Yeah, yeah. Um, you know, I I, uh, I I I like to balance balance stuff out, though. You know. Um, for me, it's important to, uh, I, and I just started this uh, about a year ago, but I, I'm taking like, um, like every, like uh, every other Saturday I take off, and uh, it's good just for me to sit back and refresh ideas and come up. You know, I could sit at home and paint more. I could spend the day painting. Um, Reintroduce it, yourself to your lady. Yes, <laughs> yes, yeah. She's, you know, I'm, I'm thankful i got a, a good woman she's like uh it's real patient and she you know she's always always happy and proud of, proud and she helps me out a lot so, so it, yeah <laughs> it's important to have that yeah yeah so what other things do you do to manage your time um man you know what i uh some people are going to be bummed at me but uh i'm, I'm i've been kind of cutting back on like any of the drinking and partying and i uh, actually joined a crossfit Good man, that's good. Yeah. Oh, actually, because of Stefano, I joined the CrossFit, and uh, he was bragging about how awesome it is, and so I joined joined one of those, and it's it's been good, you know, like wake up early, do the class, I feel good all day long, you know, and um, it, it just 
it, it's positive, you know. It, it, no more days nursing a hangover or nothing like that. Leave that to the real young guys, man. You know, that's, after a while, you just gotta get you gotta get tired of that stuff, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's but cool, it, you know. I mean, everyone wants to think that you party all the time, but when you work that much, you can't you can't have a hangover every day, you know. No, no. <laughs> it's just it just it's good though too. It it, it keeps me. Um, it keeps me at, at, at home. Um, like, I, man, I live on top of, like, bars and restaurants right here. And so uh, it keeps me up here because I know if I go down there, I'll be eating and drinking. And in the morning, I, you know, there'll be hell to pay. Right. So it's it's been, been pretty cool, good. But uh, one thing is Bob Bob lives down the street here. So sometimes the, the influences can be come from Bob, you know. <laughs> hey, you got to be careful with that guy. <laughs> yeah, that that. You know, we, we, we actually, we had some, been having some pretty good conversations because, um, you, you know, like I, I think with Bob, what, what happens is he's such a nice guy that he doesn't say no to anybody and he, he won't like at a convention, he won't just like, okay, I have to get to work, nope. you know, so, so I was telling him like, like, uh, or, or, you know, so then he doesn't start till like six in the evening. So I was, uh, we've been, me and him both been talking about how like, maybe like taking either smaller tattoos or I, I do big tattoos. So I was thinking like, I'm going to just start taking like one person for the weekend, you know, hopefully he and was, then just be able to complete something huge, you know, he was talking about just doing skulls, you know? Uh, yeah. He, yeah. He said, uh, he said that he's just probably just going to do skulls at conventions, you know, and do something small and be yeah, done yeah. with it. That's awesome. <laughs> so, you're going to be doing a seminar at the Worldwide Tattoo Conference in Italy. Are you excited about that? Are you nervous? Uh, yeah, yeah, of, of course, nervous, man. I, I um, nervous and you know, and definitely excited. I'm, I'm super honored that that I was asked to to do this. Um, I, I kind of, kind of a bit shocked that they asked me to do it, but um, no, yeah, yeah, ner nervous because you know I, the teaching thing is still new to me, you know. Um, but and um. I guess the the classes are going to be huge, so yeah, yeah. I'll definitely. She gave she gave is giving a seminar, man. Oh, that, okay. That's going to be pretty cool. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You're going to be up there with some uh, some some pretty heavy hitters. Yeah, yeah. I'm uh, pretty pretty nervous about that. <laughs> you're going to be doing a similar seminar to what you're doing, maybe in uh, New York. Yeah, I think so. Um, Probably try to step away from Flo if she gets in there talking about body suits and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, you know, I, I I have I think I feel like an importance with like um, that there's a huge importance with values and um, in in a, a tattoo holding, especially like black and gray, the no outline, the realistic stuff. So um, I don't know. I'd just like to express a little bit more of that, and, and you know, uh, ho hopefully help along some young tattooers do you enjoy teaching yeah you, you know I, I always said that if you know before the tattooing thing came along I wanted to be like an art teacher uh, so I guess it's somewhat um, you know yeah. somewhat along that line I guess well no that's kind of exactly along those lines you're just you're yeah. a tattoo art teacher yeah yeah, yeah. that's cool I was uh, I was um, was was well I was told by a long time ago by somebody that uh, the worst sin you can do is um, not teach someone something you know and I always kind of took that to heart and I always thought that, that, that uh, that's kind of my calling like to teach and and then you know the tattoo thing happened and now now I can be teaching so that's great that's really yeah. awesome have you ever had an apprentice no um, I have been working with um, with Sean Cheatham, uh, if, if for those that don't know, he's this amazing uh, uh, painter, and um, he wanted to get into tattooing. Um, but I think he's he's been real busy because he, he's also doing. Um, he teaches at Art Center, which is a real mm -hmm. well-known art school out here. So um, he's been trying to get in a few days here and there, and and I guess that's probably as close as I've come to an apprenticeship so far. <laughs> yeah. Um. Who did you apprentice with, or did you have an, a, a, uh, a regular apprenticeship? Uh, I didn't have a regular apprenticeship. 
I uh, worked at a couple different shops. It was it was like self taught. Uh, then I got in with um, Ethan Ethan Morgan and uh, Terry Morgan and Tom Berg down at uh, SoCal, uh, and this was probably about a year into tattooing. So I did did a lot of learning. Um, I, I would I guess it wouldn't be a formal apprenticeship, but uh -huh. you know it was a lot of learning art artist you know a working artist uh, apprenticeship I guess. Do you think an apprenticeship is important? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. I, I always say that I, I think tattooing wise, like I, I would be uh, way further in my career if I didn't have to just, you know, go learn on my own. You know, yeah, I, th I think so. Yeah. Where did you uh, where did you learn to paint? Um, the Sean Barber DVD. <laughs> yeah. 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 <laughs> The Sean Barber DVD, I think, was uh, I was I I was not afraid of oil at that point, so um, I did did the DVD, and then once I did that, and I just started to get familiar with it, then I took a, a seminar with him, and then uh, just took a few workshops with the guys out here, like um, like uh, Kevin Llewellyn, uh, Cheatham, mm -hmm. and uh, Michael Hassar. Oh yeah. Yeah, so it was really cool, man. Like, you know, I'm real fortunate to be here in 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 LA. Yeah, you're really lucky to have those resources out there, man. That that's you got some major painters. Yeah, yeah, and and it's cool. They you know they all like tattoo artists, so it's it's pretty cool that you know it's it's a cool little little fit right there. But uh, yeah, they, they, that's probably where I learned. I, I still try to take workshops when I get a chance. Um, have you ever been to the Paradise Artist Retreat? Uh, no, actually, no. I do know about the retreat. Um, for some reason, it it never worked out though with with the timing. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I'm, I'm usually in Europe a lot, so it, it was it's been really hard. But hopefully, with me staying home a lot more, um, it, it it can help out. When when is that? Or March 30th through April 2nd, 2015, is the next okay. one. Um, okay. The reason I ask is because I. <clears throat> I just I started painting like a year and a half ago, and I watched Sean Barber's DVD, and then I I was filming his seminar at the artist retreat, and then I started yeah. painting and stuff like that. So nice. And the nice. the, the artist retreat is great because it's all art. It's just all art all day long. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, yeah. and and there's people like Chet, Chet Czar and Sean Barber. Um, yeah. You know, Jeff Gogway and Nick Baxter all doing art seminars yeah yeah it's like, all right that, that, I'll, I'll probably have to go, go this year man. it's pretty cool yeah. it's and it's in this beautiful resort in new mexico and, oh right on. Is, it, is that new location or uh no it's same place it's, it's, uh we've had it there uh the last three times two times i guess it's in albuquerque like it's on the santa Ana pueblo in new okay. mexico that's a tamaya spa and resort really fancy place oh, it's beautiful it's Right. So yeah, cool! All those all those cats will be there this year too. So. All right, sweet. I'll, I'll, then I'll be there. Yeah. <laughs> all right, man. Well, hey, I appreciate you talking with me. This has been great. Yeah, yeah. Likewise, man. Any anytime, anytime you guys. Cool. Anytime you just want to say hello. Oh, all right, man. That's great. <laughs> awesome, man. Thank you. Thank you again, man. Cool. All right, man. Hey, I will. Uh, see you at Empire, right? Yeah, I'll be there. I'll see you there. All right. All right. Cool. Thanks a lot, man. I appreciate it. All right. Bye now. Talk to you soon.